In the world of superhero films, news and rumors surrounding upcoming projects can generate a lot of excitement among fans. One such project that has been generating buzz for quite some time is the first chapter of DC films titled Gods and Monsters. Directed by James Gunn and produced by Peter Safran, the film promises to be an exciting addition to the DC universe. However, when Gunn and Safran first revealed their plans for Gods and Monsters, they left open several doors for existing DC collaborators to stick around and play in their sandbox. There was talk about Henry Cavill playing a different role in the DC universe other than Superman, because Gunn wants to recast a role for his upcoming film Superman. Legacy. And they mentioned that they had conversations with Ben Affleck and that he was going to be a part of the architectural team that would construct the future of DC moving forward. Speculation grew about what this could mean for Affleck's involvement in the DC universe. Some even speculated that he might direct Batman. The Brave and the Bold, one of the two projects that Gunn and Safran had in mind for him. However, it seems that those plans have been abandoned. In a recent interview with The Hollywood Reporter, Affleck spoke candidly about the difficulties he had with DC and Warner Bros. During his time as Batman, when asked if he would accept an invitation to direct a film in the new DC universe, he responded with a resounding absolutely not. I have nothing against James Gunn. Nice guy, sure he's going to do a great job. I just wouldn't want to go in and direct in the way they're doing that. I'm not interested in that. It's understandable that Affleck would want to distance himself from the DC universe, given the difficult experience he had during the making of Justice League. Affleck was set to direct a standalone Batman film, but the experience of making Justice League was so unpleasant that it made him want to leave the franchise altogether. He describes it as the worst experience he's ever had in a business that's full of some shitty experiences. This news is disappointing for fans of Affleck's portrayal of Batman, as it seems that we won't be seeing him in the director's chair for any DC projects anytime soon. However, it's worth noting that there are still plenty of exciting projects on the horizon for DC, from filmmakers who are eager to work within the new universe that Gunn and Safran are creating. Despite Affleck's decision to step away from the DC universe, there is still a lot to look forward to in the world of superhero films. With the upcoming release of Superman, Legacy and other exciting projects in the pipeline, it's clear that DC is committed to delivering exciting and innovative content for fans. And while Affleck may not be a part of those plans, there are plenty of other talented filmmakers who are eager to take up the mantle and bring their unique vision to the DC universe.